Well, uh, something pretty disturbing flashed across every American screen watching commercials. Um, I'd love to know what everybody else thinks. Why is this on the TV? What is that? Yo, what is going on? That's Aaron Rodgers. And that's Aaron Rodgers. Are you Aaron Rodgers? You were. Hey, hey, what? Tell me that ain't. Yeah, so there's this really alarming woman that doesn't have eyes or a mouth, it looks like. And she just shows up right in between ads. Yeah, it is interesting that Lowe's wants to push. Maybe they were paid by this movie company. Yeah, well, um,. It could have been part of Lowe's ad. or <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought, you know, these unconscious advertisements were, you know, pretty obsolete, but I guess they're still playing it through. They are supposed to be obsolete. So if anybody wants to sue them, uh, you can call this number below that you see. 1-800-TRASH-ME. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, well, I mean, it's interesting. You know, the, it's one thing to throw it in our face. It's another thing to throw it um, not in our face. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's actually throwing into our mind. It's going past our face and actually going straight into our brain. Isn't that everything we watch? No, because some things you can literally just take it face value and you know uh, look at it right in the face and tell it no. Some things have great value. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, depending on your income, yeah. Mm. <laughs> Segregation. <laughs> yeah. What, what do you think? Do you, do you believe these unconscious advertisings uh, do work? Because, I mean, my <laughs> mind is this, if this is a national publication, like something that's being propagated nationally, this commercial, somebody paid money for this. So the question is, is, does it does it really work that well? It seems to be. Otherwise, um, all of our kids wouldn't be little Satanists. Um, everybody seems to be struggling with this Bohemian Grove owl worship stuff with uh, goat horns. Are you struggling? No, not anymore. Once I confronting the demons that you see on TV. I think you're going to tell me some elixir that you drink. <laughs> <laughs> No. Leaving one bohemian for the next. If you're asking if, you know, if I found religion, no. No, I think you'd like tell me some over-the-counter medication to help <laughs> you. <laughs> no. Okay. But no, I, I I think it's weird, though, that, you know, this sat satanic stuff has been going into Target. It's been going into Walmart. It's been going into the Bohemian Grove. These, these uh, Satanists have been everywhere trying to get into our homes. 